and, and, uh, and, and he's quite an interesting fellow, loves gospel music. And we asked him to do some of the hosting tonight to help us out in this hour. And one stipulation, he said, I'll do it on one stipulation, that you will find for me the prettiest woman, the most beautiful lady to co-host with me that you can possibly find. So I was uh, reading this, and I'm not sure uh, someone wrote this down, and I don't think this is right. Uh, Daryl Hannah, isn't she an actress? I don't think, she doesn't do gospel music, does she? Daryl, maybe that's not the name. Daryl, oh, well. Why don't you make welcome to the stage our next co-hosts, um, Charlie Waller and Daryl Stewart, I think. Uh, give them a hand, will you? She is beautiful. Hey, hey, hey. I turned Dolly down for this. You like my outfit? I love your outfit. It's against the law to kill these things. Yeah. I had to have one for chicken. Well, I, I, I told him I wanted you to look uh, nice. <laughs> and uh, what is this? Oh, me, boy. Well, you're, I like your hairdo, too. Last time I seen you a little curly. Saw oh, you had straightened it. <laughs> Must had to be the suit. Well, um, how'd you get up here anyway? I mean, you know, you came by cattle car. <laughs> Y'all don't waste your film. <laughs> Y'all want a really good picture? Come here close. Darlene. I'll almost swap hair with you. I dare you. <laughs> well, I, I could do it. I could do it. All right, come on down here. Let's get out here on this. Uh, I hope this ain't a hole down here. We're happy to be here tonight. We're lucky to be here. We're lucky to be here. <laughs> I'm just overdressed for you. If I'd have known this, I'd have worn my leopard skin underwear. He did. <laughs> this ain't a Michael Jackson suit. It ain't cut out back there. We got to put on this next group, yeah. and uh, who's on? I, me and you right now. Who's coming on? But see, they saved the best for last. They needed these ratings, and that's why they helped us to come out here to keep this thing rolling. I didn't. I'm, I'm, I didn't know you was hard of hearing. I noticed your hearing aid, didn't you? That's the one in Bryant Gumbel things. I told him if lightning hit me tonight, I had a bad day. I'm wired every which way. I got it everywhere. But anyway. <laughs> You're taking too much B12. You're not supposed to be like this. This is a gospel program. Really? I didn't, I didn't know that. Yes, it is. Some of them aren't dressed for it, I tell you. Well, you... Some of them dressed right. for the beach. All right. What? We got a hush. They're hush. telling us, they're telling us to they're do something. They're not telling me nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm going to bring on this next group. Who is it? I'll tell you in a minute, baby. <laughs> One of these guys in this next group is a fantastic songwriter. What's that got to do with it? That's got a lot to do with it. In this business, you need a good songwriter to write original stuff. And they're a family group. Come out. They're a family group. 
Oh, that hurts. <laughs> and they're a family group, and you know what happens in close family groups. They have close family harmony. And I want you to welcome to the stage here at GMT tonight, ladies and gentlemen, the Livingstons. Give them a